how to turn complete strangers into clients using video. Step one, you gotta hook them in. Now the hook them in video is gonna be a very short video designed for complete strangers. Strangers don't know you, and when they go to watch a video, they say to themselves, hmm, how long is this? And the second thing they ask is, what's in it for me? So, let's talk about five ways to hook them in, and the first one is, you gotta tell them what's in it for them. You can do this by offering a compelling result that they want right at the top of your video. So for example, Brendan Bouchard, who knows his audience well and who surveys and does research with his ideal clients all the time, he starts one, is, one of his videos like this. Let's rock and roll. Five ways to have more confidence in your life. He already knows, he's already done all the market research to find out that the people who buy self-empowerment videos of the type that he offers, their biggest problem is trust in themselves, right? So he knows it's a top problem and he's going to offer that result right at the top of his video. You really wanna offer that within the first 10 seconds. Uh, the second way to hook them in is to offer a little challenge that's gonna give that viewer a quick result. So for example, if you're a wellness uh, expert and you say, are you just really lacking energy? You're gonna take three minutes for this quick and easy smoothie and you're gonna have more energy than you're gonna know what to do with. So you challenge at the end of that video, the viewers to make the smoothie and let you know how they felt afterward, right? So this gets them engaged they make the smoothie if they drink it and they feel great guess what they believe that you are an expert so really figure out uh, something quick and actionable that's going to show if they do it your expertise another way to hook in a complete stranger is to tap into the pain that they are feeling one of the top pains that they are feeling and if you want to take a look again at my opt-in video for the interview series on camera confidence go to oncameraconfidence.co and you will see it there um, i really tap into the pain of not knowing how to use video marketing in your business a fourth way excuse me to hook in a complete stranger is to do something that's visually interesting um, you can head on over to facebook.com slash coach Michelle Moreno. That is my home, uh, that's my business page, excuse me. And on Facebook, you'll see they now allow cover videos instead of just an image. So I've put a video up there and you can check out and see like the very beginning is very visually interesting. So you really want to do things like that right at the start of your video to hook them in. Uh, you could also start a story because people they just love a story it gives us meaning it gives us hope it gives us education and we are hardwired to hear the middle and end once the story starts so you really want to get those hook them in videos down to three minutes or less step two in the process of turning a complete stranger into a client is connection Ding, 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 ding. Some people call this the nurture phase. Um, I call it connect, the connect phase, because you not only want to connect and get people to, the first one was to get them to know you. Now you want to get them to like you as a person. So you got to show yourself, and that's why you have to be yourself, and that's why uh, you really want to nurture them with something valuable. You want to consistently give valuable content and if you don't know what value is to your audience in my upcoming program I can show you how to find that out there are many ways uh, many of you already know the top problems and dreams of your clients so just do a short training series to show them how to get to their dream or to show them how to 
get out of their pain point, right? And those short training series uh, usually are videos that are anywhere from one minute long micro learning, which is uh, a great way to go, uh, up to five minutes, sometimes even a little longer than that. Um, or you can do an interview series the way I did. You can do an ongoing Facebook Live or YouTube series, right? Where every single week you go on at the same time providing valuable content and you can provide that in roughly 90 day cycles. The content will match your, uh, your business development calendar of all your offerings for the year, right? So you really have to plan all that out in advance, especially if you have multiple products. Uh, for most of you, if you're just starting out and people are not contacting you constantly as the go-to expert to ask how to work with you, you really got to stick with one area of expertise for many, many, many months. Pick one and become the go-to expert in that. All your content has to be related to it. You can't uh, become an expert in accounting when you're talking about how to fry fish. Uh, but the whole point is that you are connecting with the audience and connecting that series of content to your offer. Must be connected. Same content. And you want to lead it into that offer. Now, the third step in turning a complete stranger into a client is the sell phase. So first we had hook, hook in that stranger with a video that's three minutes or less. Then we have the connect or nurture part of it where you could have a series of videos um, where they can be a little bit longer, but you really want to connect emotionally so that people get to uh, now like you and now the sell uh, stage where people are now going to trust you because you have to be trustworthy enough to be handed their money. So that's why you have to reveal yourself and be authentic and come across as somebody who's not hiding anything. That's why you have to remove the filter and just be you. They haven't met you in person. So if you really want to, I have had people hand me money and they have never met me. Why? Because I consistently show up. Why? Because I, I am the same on camera as I am off camera. And I do my best to offer content that's valuable so that people know when they hand me the money, the content I'll deliver will be worth it.